A reading from the New Testament, a King James trans, a translation of the King James version of the New Testament by the by the Gullah people, the Gullah culture. This is a Gullah Bible. As usual, we find a we find a place in the Bible, any place. Just turn a page. Sometimes I turn a page I don't like what I see. Well, I don't, I don't mean that. I, I'm not feeling it, so I turn another page. Let me see if I'm feeling it, if I do like this. I guess I'm feeling this. Okay. Uh, page page uh, 528. Uh, this is Romans 6. Uh, this is uh, 16. I usually do derivative, derivatives of 3, but 16 and 7. You know, 6 and 1 and 7. So I'll do 7 this morning. Why not? Hey, you know, not that rules are meant to be broken. Is that you know you, you get uh, how you say, you get bored, <laughs> when you do the same, when you when you root yourself to rut yourself, you know, don't get yourself in a rut. Got to use the glasses these days, man. Sometimes it's rough. As you may or may not know, I, I do these readings every morning because I'm, I'm putting myself in the headspace of like if I was a, uh, how do you say, uh, if I was, uh, just freed from slavery. I just got my liberation, and I wanted to learn to read. The only thing, thing that's prevalent all over the place is the is the Holy Bible, you know, the Christian Holy Bible. So, so um, you know, so that's how you learn to read. But you know, to think if you don't know if you don't know anything, you're struggling with the language. Well, that's what I'm doing right now. I'm learning the culture by struggling with the language, as if I was just freed, yeah, just liberated from uh, my circumstance. Okay, 16, this is going to be pretty long, so be patient. On a note that if ye gee yourself for be sla slabby to somebody, for do all with that person, till ye for do, that mean for say ye de sabi or Ob the person e de sab anti somebody's some 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 way so if ye get yourself yourself far be sebi to sin for do we e say the sin gone make ye dead but for but if if ye Get yourself far be sebi to God. Far do ye do ya ye say God gon make all things right between self and honor. Sixteen Rome six Rome six sixteen Know ye not that to whom ye yield yourself servants to obey Ye servants, ye are to whom ye, ye obey, whether of sin unto death or of obedience unto righteousness. That's heavy. Man, I got to let that one sink in. I mean, usually it does do this twice, you know. Let's go. Here's the, uh, again, this is the uh, Gullah translation of this, uh, of the New Testament of the uh, Gullah Bible book. Oh. The King James Version of, of the uh, Scriptures. On the note that if ye get yourself far be sebi to somebody, for do all with the person tell for to do. That mean for say ye the sebi on the person is ye the sebi ain't he? Somebody, some, some way. So if ye get yourself for be savvy to sin, for do what ye say, that sin gon make ye dead. But if ye get yourself far to savvy to God, 
God do what he say. God going to make you think right, uh, right between self and owner. Again, the translation is, Know ye not that to whom ye, uh, ye yield yourself, servants to obey, his servant ye are to obey, ye obey, whether of sin unto death or of obedience unto righteousness. That's a question there. Oh, this is heavy. Again, I'm, for what I'm finding is that the Gullah translation, you don't understand everything, to me makes more sense than the King James, you know, the old English translation of, of the scripture. I mean, not that they went to the source. I guess they didn't go to the Latin or wherever they wrote it in Greek or whatever they wrote it in. You know what I mean? They just went to the King James Version, but they make they make it more make more sense. Heavy. Whoa, got to know these things. Oh, you got to know, and I got to know. I being T from the Patterson's taking the trench to bed, letting you know what I only suspect from the Gullah culture.